leave your worries and your problems on the mainland and take the ferry onto an island of incredible natural beauty. That is maybe the shortest way to describe Portugal Island. An island where the sea is blue, the sun shines brightly and the food has exquisite taste and the flowers smell like paradise. An island where you can smell the pine trees all around and enjoy the view of thousands of olive trees and the Adriatic Sea stretching all the way to Italy. The Latin name is Corchira Nigra, Black Corchula. And it is proud of its black forest, which is so dense it appears as a black hole on a beautiful pasture. As you go from the east to the west of the island, all you can see is history. Long traditions of untouched nature, friendly people, in two words, pure hedonism. As a starting point of the old town of Cortula, it is the hometown of Marco Polo and the traditional sword dance, Moreshka. It is famous for its stone walls and stone houses. Borchula town has many stonemasons taught by masters from another Croatian paradise, Dubrovnik. Borchula also was the most important trade center for wine and olive oil in the region. In Korchula you can find influence from the Greeks, Venetian and Turkish empires, and later from German and French cultures. Next to the town of Lombarda, is famous for its sandy beaches and sort of wine, Grk. Also, Lombarda has many rich archaeological sites. We now get to the little village of Pupnat. Despite the incredibly tasty food at Konobamate, Upnat is famous for its beautiful beach, Upnat Bay. Next are Chara and Smokvica. Situated at the island center a few kilometers from the sea with vineyards that stretch the imagination. For the development of their religious tourism, look no further than Blato. Its monastery is famous throughout the Dalmatian region and their sanctuary of the Blessed Mary of Jesus Crucified Petkovic that is always well observed by traveling tourists and from locals who come to pay homage. Interestingly, the traditional sword dance of Kumpania also comes from Blato. The 
The westernmost position of the island is Vela Luka. The name means Big Bay and is most assuredly the biggest bay in Dalmatia. It is an archaeological site pregnant with history stories and Big Cave is well known among foreign experts as a must-see in the world of archaeology. Velaluca is also famous for a cappella singing and is proud of its ability to produce and nurture artists. Velaluca was and is a well-known destination for artistic encounters. This love for art culminated in the worldwide Mosaic Masters in 1968. As far as combining old traditions with modern necessity, the most famous health spa of the region uses techniques of rehabilitation with mud as its main therapy. The resort spa is called Kalos. Many health experts recommend this as a wealthy experience as the results are surprisingly successful. There is also the most beautiful beach on the little island of Proist. In 2007, it was rewarded for the best beach of the year Croatia. It has a special smell of the sea which it retains and the rocks are so white that you can't look at them for too long. No man has walked this beach and not been blown away with its astounding natural beauty. If you visit Vela Luka in February, you will be impressed with carnival season. A long tradition in making great and original costumes leads to big groups of masked locals leading the festivities. Adults and children are included and everybody works together in making the whole event a night to remember. Besides the high standards of accommodation, Korchal Island offers good quality nightlife and fun for young people. Most famous is the nightclub called Boogie Jungle. With its array of modern hits and modern music, DJs and professional cocktail masters mean the revelers can party all night. Also a place to visit is the beach club Havana in Vela Luka with its spectacular night view to Vela Luka Beach in the foreground. A perfect ambient for late afternoon relaxing. Also not far from that there is a public beach with a lounge bar open all day. This is fully equipped to accommodate children while mummy and daddy have a cocktail overlooking the beautiful view of Vela Luka Bay. Portugal offers the most beautiful diving destinations.
Spending time under the sea without that pesky telephone and traffic noises is priceless for a relaxing holiday. Caves, walls, canyons and rich sea life are there for all to see when diving in and around Korchula. All destinations are nearby so you spend a minimum amount of time on the boat and a maximum amount of time under the water. Diving is an unforgettable experience for licensed divers and also for first time divers. Everybody who has a good body condition can use bikes to make their holiday more fun and at the same time be kind to our planet. Gorchula has the most beautiful beaches and coves that are not possible to reach by car. Your option is to rent a boat for a day or more and create your own adventure or romantic experience. All you need is a boat license and some experience and the magic can begin. For all information and advice, there is professional help from a tourist agency in the town center that you can rely on. Come round our way, give us a try. We have never sent anyone home feeling anything other than relaxed, rejuvenated and in love. Dalmatia is beautiful, but Korchula is paradise. Restart your energy and be ready for the rest of your life.